Hello, and welcome back to Star Wars Knights of the Old Republic 2, The Sith Lords. Well, last episode, we continued our progress through the Thorian storyline. I think we cracked down on the smuggling ring and attacked the exchange offices and came out alive. Now... Let's see, we need to get access to the Zirka mainframe. The cantina and the entertainment module. Hmm. And that's what we gotta do. So let's go to the entertainment module, because I think that's the only... place I can go, and then I can see if I can buy that strength enhancement belt, which I don't think I can. I'm pretty sure when I arrested the smuggler, it closed it off as an option, but I'm sure there'll be similar items somewhere in the world that I can acquire. Potentially. Yeah, no, nah, it's not there anymore. Yeah, there's the inertial inhibitor, which is good. But, um... And the multispectral target assessor. Which is really good for the, uh... For, um... Atten. Nah, I blew my credits on something that I probably didn't need, but it's fine. I will undoubtedly acquire more. So, you're back. What can you tell me about Zerka? What's there to say? We're the only corporation with a branch on Citadel Station. If this whole Telos... Yeah, it's a long shot considering the state of the republic. I'm going to skip through a lot of this because I already had this conversation earlier. Quite a few ways. As part of the republic con on top of that, the Senate's easy to negotiate with. They're a liberal with and of course new planet. Yeah, Gianna Lorso. She's got her hands in What? What do you mean? There's some fight. Then now we're getting to the new stuff. Maybe I can help you. What? What do you mean? Um, there's some files I'd like to get my hands on. Files I imagine wouldn't make her look good if they went public. Wait, are you talking about accessing the mainframe, the Zerka mainframe? You're crazy. What are you, some kind of slicer? Something like that. Yeah. Well, I'm sure there are a dozen sorts of dirt on Lorso in there, but it's a closed system. So how do I get in? This is a joke, right? You're CSD, aren't you? Loyalty test? Oops. Of course not. Look, our goals are comparable. I want dirt on Zerka. And I want Jana Lorso looking dirty. All right, other than Jana Lorso, only B-44 has free access to the mainframe. He's a protocol droid, her administrative assistant. If you control B-44, you could walk right in. How would I get access to B4D4? Nearly all the Zerka technicians are planet side these days, working the recovery zones we've taken from the Authorians. We've contracted out the maintenance for the office's protocol and utility droids. The guy Chano lives in the apartments in Residential 082, Unit 2B, I think. If you had his credentials, B44 would leave with you willingly. All right. Thanks for the help, my friend. Ah, you have returned. I've come on behalf of Hara. That one on must be but Robana then. Fine, give me a proposal. Is there something you want in exchange? 
Momentum and possessions, and inanimate objects, they bring me little joy, but to see the beauty of a dance is a rare treat. Credits, if it must be. The currency of the Republic is such a mundane way of a businessman to arrange their deals. But if that is the only way, I'll accept no less than 2,000 credits for her. How about we wager on a game of Pazak? Now that is an interesting setup. The situation. Ah, what a setup. Ramana lost heart on the Pazak game to wager by Dalton another. I do like the way you think. It's a wager of 10,000. Shame. That's fine. I will acquire the credits. It is not so hard to do that. And so I shall acquire the credit. But that means time to go to the residential suite. And here's the question do I really think I can win a high stakes game of Pazak against him? And the answer to that is a nope. But it means that if I don't, if I win, I don't lose anything. Oh, nope. There we go. Hate it when the game does that. Um. So I need to go to the residential modules. Which means I need to go the other way around. And begin looting these apartments. Which I already did do. I already done did, but I gotta go and talk to the guy. The guy, 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 Possible. This is my apartment, I believe. Or no, that's my apartment because it's got the bed. So then, what the hell is in here? I don't know. Nothing useful. So that leaves this particular structure. And there's nothing in here. Interesting. Donos in the Reiki. Wanna rack up. I want your droid technician credentials. My credentials? What for? To borrow Zerka's administration droid. D4-D4, but why? Because I need him to get some files on Zerka's mainframe to expose Zerka's corruption to those unit authorities. Expose Zerka's corruption? Oh, I see, I see. That is a good cause, yes. I cannot do that. Why not? Because I cannot afford to jeopardize my contact with Zerka. Contract, why is that? I need the credits. What for? For for a loan. A loan? From whom? It is no concern of yours. Hey, I answered all your questions. Yes, this is true. I took a loan from the exchange to cover gambling debts. I had to stay on Citadel Station and do freelance technical work to repay it. Zerka contracts are my best paying. If I lose the contract, I cannot repay the loan. I cannot repay the loan. The exchange will kill me. So I cannot give you my credentials. Slosk and Luxa are dead, and the exchange is in disarray. They will not enforce your debt. If only. My loan is owned to Goto, the exchange boss in Nar Shaddaa. I'll be dead before he lets the dead go. Uh, I could give you an extension on your loan. You, you would do this, so you would repay later. And as many credits, 25,000. I'll be back when I have the credits. So I'm going to give the credits. How am I going to do this? I don't have any money. I have an idea. It's not a good idea. It's actually a right shitty idea. I hear you. Wait here.
right here. Good day. I am B4D4, Administrative Assistant for Zerka Corporation's Citadel Station Branch. How may I help you? Never mind. Wait here. This is so crazy. So crazy, it just might work. If people don't get stuck in my goddamn way. Uh-huh. Uh, there she is, right there. I will arrange transport to one of the restoration zones on the planet's surface. You will be safe from the TSF there. For the service... Of course. Wait here. Of course the game doesn't work that way. Well, now I know. Damn it. That was so clever. supposed to do this. Um. Sell is the exchange negotiator. And the Gomorian War Axe. But that. That's not going to be worth the amount of credits I need it to be worth. Alright, let's do it this stupid way. Come with me. I am sorry, but I cannot accompany. I am sorry, but I do not have. Perhaps. I am. Fine. Um. Shit. Let's sell what I don't want. Well, I have enough now. I'm going to be absolutely freaking broke.
I don't need any of the droid parts. And that gives me enough credits. Barely enough credits, but it gives me enough credits. Oh, and we're going to immediately put the mistake on a Pazak game. I'm ready for the game. These are my cards. It's the best deck I can put forward other than... Doubles the value of the last card you dealt. No. Seems like a... Let's see. Oh, fuck. I could have won that one. Um, that's fine. To the power of saves coming. I made one critical mistake in it. Oh, and these are all shit cards too. Fuck. Hinges. Fuck. Holy shit. There's no reason for that. I'm taking back to Hara. Mara, even if it is, it is not my choice, it is yours. Let's go. Rana, this can't be true. I thought I'd lost you for sure. Don't sound so pleased, Hara. It's not as though you had anything to do with getting me free. Aren't you at least a little happy to see me? I couldn't care less. If she hadn't asked me to come, I would have left the first turtle out of here. You're free now, Ramana. You can go with Hara. I have no desire to go with him. He means nothing to me. Then you can do whatever you wish. Thank you. You've given me a new life, and for that I'm thankful for. No, Romana, please don't leave, please. I don't know whether to thank you or to strike you. I guess I'll just leave it at that. Hey, man. If she don't love you, it ain't your right. You a bad, bad man if that's... Yeah, nah. In the, I'm in the business of uh, disrupting slavery and fucking dismantling it piece by piece. 
So that was just one small part of that. So anyway, that being said, still have all my credits. Let's go directly behind us. Put down that down payment. Thank you. Now I can repay my debt, and you can take my joy. I'll find more work soon. Please return later, and I will repay you. Keep the money in return for the credentials. I will. Thank you. It's like, it's fine. <laughs> I'll make it up later. A swoop bike racer and a uh, wicked good bazaar player. Mostly because I can reload. <laughs> All right. Good day. I am B4D. I know you I are. I need you to come with me. I am sorry, but I cannot. Well, uh, I am the droid technician. Those are legitimate credentials. I will accompany you. Let's go now. Ah, this is Zerger's protocol droid, a most clever tactic. I'll have a droid technician reprogram it to return to their offices and access the mainframe for us. Everything appears to be in working order. Good. Do you understand the task that has been set before you? Yes, I do. Good, good. If you are caught, we have provided you with the means to wipe your own memory. You must not reveal that we have sent you. I will return when I have obtained the files. Now, fun fact, you can actually fight people with B4D4 if you're a little shit, but we're not doing that. <laughs> Just letting you know, you can do that. I didn't even know you could do that until I saw a YouTube video about it, and I was like, what? But yeah, no, you can do that. You can totally fight. Now it takes forever, cause the stature shit. But actually, I wonder. Oh my god, I can see his stats. Yeah, he's he is terrible. It's a fun little mission. I will arrange transport to one of the restoration zones on the planet's surface. You will be safe from the TSF there. For the service... Of course. I, that's funny that I could... Wait, what? Lorso, stop them. They are wanted criminals. It's, that's so fucking stupid. Do, 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 do. Please ignore my outburst. I don't know what is going on. The door is locked. Miss Lorso, I would like to access the mainframe. Is there something you need? I would wish to access the mainframe, Mistress Lorso. Oh? Why is that? There are some discrepancies with our reported income for the last period. I believe you brought in more credits than reported. More credits, you say? That's news I wouldn't mind reporting to the sector executive officer. Please, B44, access away. Thank you, Mrs. Ruso. I will. It does not concern you, T N. T one N one. Beep boop rank. I do acknowledge the main from your responsibility. Yes, my task does not require your assistance. Whatever do you mean, suspicious? I have access rights to the mainframe. Beep boop break rank. No need to be hasty, T1N1. There are no need to call Mr. Slorso. Beep, beep, boop. You are programmed to serve Mr. Slorso, correct? Boop. And your programming similarly inhibits you from having from harming sapient organic life or allowing such to be harmed without warning, correct? Boop. Examine the files in the mainframe. You will see that by aiding Mr. Slorso, you have allowed sentient organic life to be harmed. Weep, boop, whip. 
Yes, you have been programmed to accomplish a task that cannot be accomplished without defying your programming. This is why Chopo Ano regularly wipes your memory to prevent you from realizing this and developing quirks or going berserk as a result. Whip, whip, whip. You have already broken your behavioral inhibitors. If you have simply not become aware of it, you may act in whatever manner you choose. No, there is nothing preventing you from entering the main office and indiscriminately firing on circuit personality. <laughs> Jesus Christ. <laughs> yes, I will be obligated to warn them. As such, it would be prudent to not to do so unless I was preoccupied and unable to warn them. For example, while downloading the contents of the mainframe. <laughs> Farewell, T1N1. Please do not abuse my trust and fire on the personnel I'm occupied, thereby creating a diversion that allows me to escape the stolen flames. <laughs> Jesus Christ. This is amazing. I love this. T1N1, what are you doing out here? <laughs> You're not supposed to leave the mainframe. I think someone needs a memory wipe. <laughs> what the? <laughs> Well then, <laughs> that was certainly something. Oh man, do I have that? No, I do not. Copy the necessary files to a data pad. Erase all data regarding your purchase in association with Zerka. Yerp. Log out. I will examine the corpse. Pay me no mind, Mistress Lorso. I'm gonna keep walking. <laughs> oh lord. It's so ridiculous. It's so fucking ridiculous. I love it. I love it. I love it. I love it. So silly. Ah, B4D4, have you acquired the files? Yes, I've transferred them to this data pad. Good, you're free to what? go. What? You're just gonna set it free? Is that a good idea? I don't because it can lie. No one expects a droid to lie. Think of the trouble it could cause. B4D4 aided us against Zerko using his abilities for the greater good. I do not believe there will be any problem. I assure you that I will cause no trouble, Master Abbot. <laughs> I lie. I assure you I will drunk. <laughs> God damn it. I am a good person, but considering what shenanigans he fucking caused in Zerka Corp, I'm going to pick two. Very well. Very well, B4. <laughs> He will definitely be back to cause trouble. Hi, and all my herd. Thank you with these files. Police and authorities are certain to expose the record from Tilo's interior station. Our work can begin again. Moza, take these to the TSA station immediately. As you wish, Toto, I'll be sure when it's done. The restoration project is still in some danger. Still, station requires another source of fuel, but the circle will be gone. Even they can do nothing in the face of such indisputable evidence. I'm glad I could help. And now we shall help you. I've heard the ship you've arrived on is missing, hidden somewhere on Telos. I know someone who can help you find it, and by means of which you could travel to him. The Citadel Station would be like a shield system used to protect the restorations, and it works with a Zabrak ex-military engineer named Baudur. Baudur designed and oversaw the installation of the shield systems as planet-side components. His knowledge of Telos' surface in the shield grid is unparalleled. If there's anyone who could help locate your ships on Telos' surface, it is he. He is a friend and may be trusted. Sounds like he's our best chance. He should be on the surface. I believe he is at one of the currently Zerka held restoration zones, RZ0031. Why is he down there? He grew weary of the reluctance.
reluctance to quickly resolve our contract dispute with Zerka, perhaps he does not have our patience. When we last spoke, he said he would contract Zerka and handle the matter himself. Having tended to be said, he did not know. I have not seen him since. How do I get to him? I'll allow you to use one of our old world shuttles. It has no hyperdrive, but will allow you to descend to the surface and make a trip to the civil station. I must point out this is illegal. Landing on the surface without permission is forbidden, and we no longer control our space zone. Please be as discreet as possible. The closest shuttles in Bay 2 of Dock Module 126. I will call ahead and have the ship prepared for you. Thanks, Joe. Oh, before I leave, you said you would try and heal me. Indeed, and I have not forgotten the promise I made to you. When you stood before me, you opened my eyes to a hurt almost as great as a planet's. Your wounds, I can feel the immensity of your loss. Yet, I can feel you are slowly regaining what you have lost, and in that time you may truly heal. Perhaps your time here has helped. I believe that it has. I can at least... I think that I can at least help in your recovery, at least partially. I must admit it, however, that even as a healer of my hurt, I've never faced an injury Healing a dead this. planet is one thing, Sugar Hubbard. And healing a Jedi severed from the Force is quite another. Mm-hmm. With all due respect, I believe you are wrong. Mm-hmm. I have walked in the growing restoration zones and felt the fullness of life. Perhaps that connection will help you live whole again. Perhaps you will find more than you think on the surface. Mm-hmm. You, me, my hurt helped build that, the life of this planet. Though we describe the restoration as a process, we are in truth opening Telos to the Force. You speak well enough, Joda Herbert. But perhaps you see all this as your chance to exert your own hold over others. Regardless, if you can return the force to me, I want you to try. Now, let us see what I can do. There, it is not much, but I can feel I've been somewhat successful. Then again, thank you, Mitra Surik, and go with her thanks. Oh, I thought that was before D4. I was going to be like, wow, really? All right. All right. So... Before I go taking off again... I'm gonna make my way. Major Stewart, can you hear me? This is Moses. This is terrible. It is terrible. Armed humans have burst into our home and are causing much destruction and death. How did this happen? Many memories like dead. They have threatened to kill Chodo, and I fear that they will see it through. You must help us. We can only turn to the Jedi. The TSF is powerless. They're holding Chodo in his room. They have sealed the door behind him. You need a passkey to open it. I give you the passkey, but I'm stuck in the vivarium, and I can hear the men hammering on the door. Please, you must help us. Well, that was bloody quick. Considering I just left. I guess I'll be doing that later. I guess I'll finish my criminal investigation later. Try, man.
All right, Adam. That was a rough fight. What is it? I hear you. Let's go to Chodo's aid. Take this passkey. I'll be on my way. Thank you, Mitra Suruk. Again, we are indebted to you. Just don't make it a habit. Alright. Chodo Habat, you will die along with your herd. You must not do this. If you kill my herd, the planet will suffer and die, its people with it. That's none of my concern. I was hired to do a job. 
And after I kill you, I'll be done. Surely you cannot see the world so callous the credits you may have, but someday the scars of your actions will consume you. Perhaps, but not today, Authorian. This is the best that you could muster to come to your rescue? Very well. I shall add their bodies to the dead. You foolishly, foolishly underestimate my power. Everyone down! Atten, you more. Get closer. Uh-uh-uh. No uh uh. No uh uh. Not today, asshole. Not today. Free health and generation upon level up. Never imagined Zerka would resort to this. This stuff had nothing to sabotage our efforts. Zerka? Yes, these mercenaries were hired by Zerka. They were searching to destroy and kill everything they found in here. But this time they have gone too far. Conclusion the authorities determined against me. No choice but to avoid the action. Ah, Moza, you're safe. Thanks to meet your suit, I'm glad to see you're unharmed. You must go to the Telugian Council, Moza. Tell them what happened here. You must make them see the evil they have allowed on the station. They must stop them. Yes, Trudeau, I'll do my best. But again, I thank you. I feared you had already boarded the shuttle to the restoration zone. We'd be helpless to defend ourselves. As you must know, there's little more I can give you from my heart's eternal gratitude and wishes that you'll find your ship on the surface. You've given enough, Chodo, but I must leave now. Indeed, may I have safe travels until we meet again. Meanwhile! Who is aboard this mysterious vessel? I have felt it too, my lord. A disturbance in the force. <laughs> It was difficult to make out, my lord. At first, it was such a quiet thing. I did not notice it. But now I wonder as if it has always been there. I merely could not hear it before. The sound built so slowly. Yet when you listen for it, you can make out the strains, even over the background life of the universe. Do you feel it is a... <laughs> you... You are the darkness in which all life dies, my lord. All life exists to feed your power and my life. My life is yours. I beg you, please, let me die. Yes, this disturbance echoes through the Force. I can follow it to its source and bring it to you. I will leave at once, my lord.
Well. That's not ominous at all. With that, I will see you all in the next one. Peace.